purse. First one of the messages for a phrase. One of the messages for the Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Okay. We have the Seven of Pentacles. Okay. Hello. Seven of Pentacles. I see you guys investing your time, investing your energy, and possibly even investing your money into something this month. Could be something um, new that you're doing. If it's time, it definitely could be investing your time in someone. Um, in school, in a business, whatever it is, but I see whatever you have invested your time in is going to, you're going to start seeing like some fruits of your labor this month, and it could be something that you've invested um, time and energy into like this past month, or this past year. We do have four of cups here, so I definitely feel that some of you guys may be um, rejecting someone. Okay, yeah, some of you guys could be rejecting an offer from someone, and it could, okay, you have the ace of wands. I don't know if you can see it because my ring light is too bright. But um, yeah, I do feel like there could be somebody coming into your life or someone coming back into your life. I kind of feel like it's somebody coming back into your life or wanting to and you rejecting the offer. It could be a Sagittarius. We do have the Temperance card here with the Queen of Swords. So I see you not, not really entertaining this offer. Or the advice could be not to entertain this offer. Here's what are the messages for Aquarius? Okay. Yeah, we have the six of what the fuck. Okay. So we have the six of cups. Somebody from your past wants to come back into your life. Okay. Yeah, ten of cups with the king of pentacles. It could be a earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. But I really see you not entertaining um, this person. I do feel like you could feel as if their offer is still insignificant, and you guys still don't really have like. I feel like you've just dropped the situation, like um, being getting back together with this person is just not an option but i do feel like this person wants it's almost like now they want to be um have this ten of cups with you and maybe before they didn't so i really see you guys not entertaining that offer or the advice is not to entertain that offer and i feel mostly it's because it's just going to bring drama we do the five of wands here so i do see you guys um investing your time and energy into something else anyway what is the seven of pentacles Why is the Seven of Pentacles here? Also, feel you could be investing your time into someone else as well. We do have the Chariot card here, so I really feel like you guys are focused on success, focused on, um, I almost feel like bringing change into your life. We have the Death card and the Tower here, so I really feel like you guys are really making an effort to change your life. Uh, whether this is changing uh, the way you make money, change like changing your body, changing your diet, whatever it is, I feel like you guys are really making an effort this month. Um, to make changes so and I do feel like you're going to succeed with whatever those changes are we do have the four of cups here with the queen of pentacles so yeah I see you I'm um, rejecting somebody who wants to come back in and I do feel like it's because you're just very focused on yourself and focused on your stability right now um, financial stability mental and emotional what is the ace of wands here Whoa. Whoa. so what is the ace of wands here I'm also getting that somebody is trying, somebody misses you. We have the five of pentacles here. Somebody's trying to manifest you back into their lives. I don't know why these spirits tell me bump in. I feel like you're going to bump into someone, whether this is at a gathering, a party, whatever. But I almost feel that this person wanted this to happen. Wanted you to bump into them. That's interesting. Okay. Five six of cups here. I do feel like a lot of you guys could be investing money as well. I do feel some of you guys could be worried about investing money, but advice is still to do it because I see it working out for you. I see you being successful with whatever this is. Oh, hello. There's a lot of pinnacle energy coming out. We have the king of pentacles, queen of pentacles, seven of pentacles. Like there's a lot of money energy surrounding you and I feel like that is your focus this month. Whatever it is that you're doing to make money, whatever you're starting, whether this be a business, something online, whatever, you're going to be successful with it. I do feel also multiple streams, so if you guys could be um, adding more streams of income. Why is the Ten of Cups here? Well, the Ten of Cups is a card of being just very, being very satisfied with your life. I do feel of a lot of you guys, or if some of you guys are in relationships, I feel like you're very satisfied with your relationship. What about the Ten of Cups? Okay. 
Yeah, Eight of Pentacles with the Sun card. I really feel like you guys, you and the person that you're with, for some of you guys in a relationship or even in a new relationship, I feel like you both very are very dedicated to making this work. Like to being happy with the Sun card and being happy together. Like the Ten of Cups with the Sun, that is like pure happiness. And I feel like you guys are just both on the same page. We do have the King of Pentacles here with the Queen of Pentacles. So whoever you're with currently is like a perfect match for you. Like I definitely feel that you guys are on the same page. It could be an Earth sign. Why is the King of Pentacles here? Oh, oh. Okay. Too many. Why is the King of Pentacles here? Okay. We have the Page of Cups with the Nine of Swords. I feel like worried. Some of you guys could be overthinking or worrying about something. However, I feel like whatever you're worrying about is going to have a good outcome. I feel like you're going to get some very positive news about whatever you're worried about. You could even be worried about somebody else, worried about finances, worried about um, whatever, but everything's going to be okay. The Page of Cups, this represents good news. So I see you um, something good coming out of whatever you're worried about, or like things just turning out better than maybe you expect. Ooh. Here, what is the advice, okay? The advice, we have the call card, so, okay. We have the call card. This is about, pretty much about your calling, but it's about doing what you know you should do, regardless of your situations regardless of whatever and I feel like that's exactly what you guys are doing with the seven of pentacles and the chariot I feel like you are making more time for doing um, things that you're passionate about if you want to start a business making more time um, for that and I do see that really working out for you this month okay so we have the three of wands and the sun card so I love that we have the sun card here twice because this is like double confirmation that you are going to be very satisfied with things this month very satisfied with outcomes that you have this month also, just being very happy, we do have the Three of Wands here. So this card represents your ships coming in, things that you've been working for, results. I definitely see you getting results from whatever you're doing. So I hope this was a good reading for you, Aquarius. If you would like a personal reading, there's information down below on how you can get one. And if you would like to see me do other stuff besides tarot, then my vlog channel is down below. So yeah, enjoy the rest of your day.